We thank God for this mighty word. A measure for God's pleasure. And it just reminds me of Worldwide Vision Day. Where God gave us a measure of the revival. God gave us a talent. A talent. Hi. He didn't give us a shower first. He gave us a talent that we got to prove ourselves under God. Then he gives the shower. My God. Are you there? It was on Worldwide Vision Day that these militants attack the country that has the most effect on mankind and the world. We can go deep into that. You got to keep coming. You got to keep coming. Everybody quarterbacking. And I've seen nowhere where there, there, was any, there was any prophecy about this but where you are. Look online. It's right there. It's right there. That this country Israel will be persecuted. It's right there. It's online. That there will be turmoil in Israel. Come on. You got to know. You got to know God does it. Because if the, if the prophecy came 15, uh, uh, 21 days ago, they would become looking for who to prophesy. You got to get there. You got to know how God does things. Are you there? Are you getting me? Yes, it's not just what you want. God knows everything. Huh? If it was 21 days ago, who spoke would have to go hide it. How did you know? And the country with the best intelligence in the world knew nothing. Come on, somebody. So you know something that is better than intelligence. I, I, I could show you have, you have to keep coming. I could show you in the Bible in Daniel 11 where the Bible said that they will seek for the backsliders to get intelligence from them concerning church because they can't manage church. Come on, somebody. Church is revelation. And you want me to read it? Let's see. Come on, let me read it. Let's see. Is, is your fault? Oh, just say, come on. Because I tell you, I'm going to be sure it's your fault. Daniel 11. That in 11, they cannot get intelligence without the church. Even though they have artificial intelligence, computer that claim to be more academically advanced than man. Huh? Oh. <laughs> and they know they can't get it from the one who's in the church now, but the one who backslide. So could you give me some intelligence? How they know? You know, in the past, they always accuse us. And says, somebody tell us these things. So how you know that was going to happen? Until earthquake come, no government can't tell us about earthquake. Oh, no. Come on, somebody. Come on, hash te basta baha. Daniel 11 and verse 30. Let me read. Daniel, put it online if you can. He said, for the ships of Shittim shall come against him. Hmm? That's the beast. Some folks think is is um what the name of the of the militant group. <laughs> this is a, this is the first place gonna tell you what I'm gonna. Is him? Is him? Amen. Oh, let, let, let me make it be easier. Yeah. Can not know Is it? Amen. You come and can do that. Is it? Yes, <laughs> come on, you don't get me. That's why we don't we don't call it him much. So we call it the system. Is the system? You talk, you think they are wicked? When the system come, you'll see. You don't go in the rapture and you'll see. It's the system. I don't, I don't want to. You got to keep coming on. Listen, listen. You, you better want to know these things. Because the Bible says, during adversity, we must consider. You know, have to be you. From, from this adversity on the earth. And the Bible said, we are the offspring of Israel. Come on, somebody. You got to consider. Yes. You can't just go normal. Come on, Come on somebody. You got to know something. Yes. Who's next? Come on. Oh, yeah. And here's how you know. Read it me. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me just read it. For the ships of Shittim shall come against him. Him. Someone say him. Hmm. 
Therefore he shall be grieved and shall return and have indignation against the holy covenant. That's his botheration. The system, that's their botheration. The holy covenant, the church, that's their botheration. How they get to do this? How they draw people? How they know this? All right. Huh. So shall he do. Huh. He shall even return and have, come on now, come on now, come on now, intelligence. Read it, read it. With them that what forsake the backsliders, that forsake the covenant. That's the best they can get. They want to know how we survive. They want to know. They want to know how you stand. Come on, they can't handle it. So they have to go, go to the backsliders, the one who won't go to church. Come on, doing the church. What do you call it? The church age. They want to get them. Could you tell me how you get to do this? How you get to know this? Listen. They say, how come we never know? Because remember that earthquake, the tsunami, affect the whole east. All them countries, people die in so many countries beyond Japan. And a, a, a television station with 30 million viewers sent us a letter. The letter is still in the office. And said, we never know you prophesied. Will you please Whenever God show you this again, could you please contact us? Intelligence. That's the best they can get. Come on. But we got better than intelligence. Come on, somebody. We have vision. Somebody. I tell you, you got to come to church. The Bible says in Proverbs 29, 18. Shabba baha taba. My God, where there is no vision. What happened? What happened? What happened? What do they need now? It's not intelligence. They need revelation. They need vision. In Bible times, every king will not do nothing unless they contact the visionary. Come on, I'm talking modern right now. Come on. Ah, something this happen and you don't go to a visionary. The Bible says in Jeremiah 9, 12, there's always somebody who know. Jeremiah 9, 12, somebody. Well, come on, how could, how could the best intelligence in the world get surprised like that? Wow. Nobody know. I'm going to leave something with you. And stop as I'm supposed to stop. There is a country that is feared that they might soon get nuclear. Hmm? They are feared by those in adversity right now that they are on the brink of getting nuclear. Then if you can find out when those who make the attack, if, if, if you didn't have the intelligence, then how are you going to know when they get nuclear? Oh <laughs> Somebody. I hear somebody. Brenda Katama. You have to come to Christ and get a revelation. My God. Tell them, keep on coming out. They got to come to church because we can't say everything. One time. They got to come to church. This is where you're going to be safe right now. In your house. They don't want to kill us. They didn't kill us here. The only reason why we weren't is because we were on the field. You hear some Brenda Shebra Katahata. Things happen, you have to be in church. Huh? Where we work, every night it increase. Come on. Every night it increase. Oh, yes. You see, you're crazy. Come Sit on. home while pastor preach. Come on. You put up your foot on the hassock. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. While pastor wiping sweat. You're reckless. Every night it increase. Oh, yes. oh, yes. If we're, we're there, you know, the town would... The church will be full of it. You did. It, oh. People are dying now. You need revelation. Oh, yes. You need vision. Oh. You know, you go and meet me TV, TV guide you. You know? Glory to God. And somebody say, well, they ask me which side you're on and whatsoever. I'm going to tell you more. <laughs> they are all on one side. 
I don't want to teach her nothing. You don't want to teach her nothing. How do I know? It's the Bible I'm going to give you. <laughs> you want to give you the Bible? Is, is, is you, is you gonna, it's going to cause yourself to be late. You want me to give you the Bible? Come on. You, you want to say yes or no? You guys want to go home late. <laughs> Come on, turn to Psalm 83. Turn to Psalm 83. And people run go and look and, and use media to say we're who, 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 which side you're on. What are they talking about? What are they saying? Which should we agree with? You know? Uh, it's not half and half. No, it's, it's one side they all on. Go check the Bible. Mm. I'm not going to read all of it. Oh my God. Verse 3. He said, They have taken crafty counsel against thy people. Circle around put Israel. <laughs> hoo, hoo, hoo. And they have consulted against the hidden ones. The protected ones. My brother, God, about Israel. Verse 3 of Psalm 83. Verse 4. Now read it in verse 4 there. They have said. <laughs> Come on. You're not going to agree with me. Let us cut them off. From being a nation. That the name of what? It's right there. It's, it's right there. Come on, somebody, that, is, that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. You want to know how much, though? You want to know how much? <laughs> Where everybody, which side everybody on? Just read the next verse. Hmm. For they have consulted together with one consent. Are you there? This is the Bible, you know? Yeah. They are confederate, confederate, they are all together. <laughs> they are, we do last part, they are confederate against thee, against the church, against Israel. They are all on one, don't let them trick you. Come on, I'm going smart. They are all on that side. But you have to be in church. You have to be born again. You have to know God, my God. You have to, you have to receive Christ as your savior. Ah, and he, he said the secret of the Lord is with them that fear him. Psalm 25, 14. My God, my God. Someone say amen. amen. I'm not going to give you no 